Hi guys, this is me, Rusty78609, making a fashion statement in his Gildan t-shirt and his favorite shorts. It's Friday afternoon, I don't know exactly what time, early afternoon, and I'm going to try to do this demo of this thing I got in the, in the mail. It's called, a, it's an Anchir privacy tent or shower tent, and uh, it's for camping. In other words, if you're out camping, it gives you a a little instant tent to do your thing in. You can use it to, you know, for like using a toilet or whatever. But anyway, it comes in this cute little carry thing like this. See this? Okay, it's got a strap here. You, can, you know, you can do it like a backpack. You got that? I don't mean, I don't know why you'd want to do that, but if you did want to, you could. Okay, so this is it. Okay, this is going to be live, folks. I don't know a damn thing about this thing. All I know is uh, we're going to see. <laughs> I did try to read the instructions. Forget the instructions, okay? Forget the instructions. Do not even worry about reading. Anyway, it's a cute little bag. Put the ba bag B goes over there. This is th this is it. And there's a gnat trying to get in my ear, driving me nuts. Okay, but basically, uh, watch this. It tries to set itself up, okay? I mean, it's really, it really does. I'm not kidding, but watch this. Uh. There you go. Okay. And that's that. Okay. All right. Turn it around. Okay, this is the front of it. Right here. Front, front. Okay, it's got a zipper. It's got four four little places on the outside. It's got four little strap things to do the stake, so you can stake it down. In my opinion, it would not be worth. It would not be very good in the wind. Okay, in windy conditions, it would be. It, I don't know. You can try it and see what you think. But anyway, this is the front door, or the main door, and you just unzip it all the way around both sides, and then you can roll this up right here this flap and it's got these cute little deals here that uh, that hook to another little strap in the, in the back here but I'm not going to see any of that right now because I'm trying to get this video bid okay so we're just going to put this up here and hope that the wind doesn't keep blowing it over in my face so anyway that's the inside see it okay plenty of room plenty of room actually I can I can stand up all the way. See, I'm, all, I'm in here. Okay, here this thing comes, and I knew it was going to do that. I just knew it was going to do that. But I don't want to roll, roll it up yet. But anyway, inside is plenty of room. There's actually a place to... Uh, there's actually a place to... It won't stay there. I know it won't. Why is it just windy, windy enough to blow this off? Okay, but inside there is enough room to stand up. You saw me do that on, on the, uh, it's got a window here at the back. It's also got a little place to put stuff here. And then a little strap right here to hang maybe some clothes. You couldn't hang too much because it's just not that sturdy. Okay, but anyway, that's it. That is a... A N C H E E R and cheer privacy tent. You could use it for a shower, you could use it for a restroom, uh, you could use it for a deer blind if you wanted to, I guess. And this little folding table, I got this at, at Walmart. I did a video on it earlier, but you, if you're interested in folding tables, you can get this one for like, I don't know, 15, 20 bucks at Walmart. Anyway, you just pull it like this push it together very very easy lightweight but anyway yeah you can put this in here and set you uh, either a sprayer or a, a gallon jug or whatever and take you a shower now there's no floor and the, there's no floor no floor in there and that's really good because you wouldn't want a floor if you're going to take a shower just get you a, a pad from Walmart of some kind to stand on to keep your feet out of the mud and you're good to go. But 
anyway, that's that. It's got a it's got a flap on the top you can open to ventilate, and then there's a flap you can open uh, at the back. Just opposite opposite this front opening is another flap you can open, and it gives you a window about like that. Okay. And so let me get my fancy folding table out of the way. It does come with four little metal stakes, but they're not the strongest looking stakes in the world, if you know what I mean. And so you might want to get some better ones, or get some of those big long nails that they, you can get them at uh, Lowe's. You know, those big long nails, get some of those. And, uh, but anyway, that's that. So now, now that you've seen it, let's see if we can get it back together. Okay. This is live, folks. This is Rusty78609 in Central Texas doing a, I don't want to call it a product demo because I don't do, well, you know, I do, I do demos on products that I buy, and but I'm not recommending this one way or another. Would I use it? I'll be frank with you, I doubt it. You know, why? Because I, I don't never need anything like this. But, but it, you know, it, I, you know, I might. I'm not going to say I'm not. I might. You know, because it doesn't take up much space, and I'm fixing to put it down right now. This now putting it back down is a trick. I can't remember how I did it. Uh, I watched. Uh, it, it tries to go back together by itself. I'm telling you, if you just let it go, it almost does it by itself. Yeah, there you go. So there's that. And there's that. See, it, it, yeah, you just, it, it tries to put itself back together. I will give it credit for that. It tries to help you. <laughs> so we got that much done. And then the trick is, and I'll stand sideways so maybe you can see this a little better. You put your foot down at the bottom, okay, and hold it. And then you just fold it in half according to the instructions which are and then you take it down all the way like this and then you kind of twist it like this yeah because it, it'll try to put itself back together I'm telling you. I mean you can feel it working real hard to get itself back together and you can see that it didn't do it this time all right well, I'm going to try it one more time, and then you'll have to watch the video yourself. Yeah, it did it. Okay, push it down. Oh, okay, then I did it. Ha! <laughs> okay, oh, I know what it is. I got to do it this way. That's it. Okay, okay. Yeah, see how easy that is? Yeah, perfect. Well, anyway, that's close. And then you put it back. And then, <laughs> and then you put it back in the bag, and you live happily ever after. And that, no, it's okay. I mean, you know, if you were if you're going camping and you've got ladies or children or you know people that don't want to just go out and poo poo or shower with nature, uh, or that are a little uh, squeamish about doing stuff like that, then. That would come in handy. Is the price of it? I don't know, thirty-five to forty-five dollars, depending on where you get it. But again, just for the for the sake of, you know, somebody sent it to me. I don't know if it was a viewer or a company, but it, nothing was in the box. So all I got was this in a box, and that's it. So, and cheer. It's a privacy tent, and it can be, you know privacy is privacy. It can be used for a shower, a toilet. You, know, you could actually use it as a deer blind. I mean, you could actually, I guess you could figure out a way to sleep in it if you were small. <laughs> but anyway, so guys, that's it. And that was what I got in the mail that was the quote secret. And there was no mail call today because I didn't get any mail. Boo, 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 boo. I didn't get any mail. <laughs> anyway, having said that, guys, thumbs up. Carpe Diem from Central Texas, USA. This is Rusty78609 live and in color. And for those of you that want to support or contact me, you can do so at, just send me a correspondence at to Rusty78609, scratch that, just send it to Rusty, P.O. Box 1446, Kingsland, Texas, 
78639. In one of the videos I said 609. It's 78639, Kingsland, Texas. PO Box 1446. Also, if you full time, if you RV or you go camping in a car or whatever, uh, check out my playlist on my homepage for RVing and or camping in a car, a Toyota Prius. And uh, so, anyway. <sighs> You know, in a wind, it wouldn't be very good. No, in a, on a windy day, uh, you know, again, you'll just have you know, make up your own mind. How much do you need your privacy? You know, me, I just stand out there in the, in, in the light, and I don't care who looks at me. Not a bit. You know, anyway, thumbs up, carpe diem, adios, bye-bye. Buy USA Made when you can and all that stuff. Bye, guys.